Cocoa, 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 cocoa. I'm just a Ravens fan. I'm just a Ravens fan. Quick recap. I wanted to holler at y'all. I had to take a day to, to let to let it all settle in. To get the, you know, the after first game jitters out the way. I don't want to jump out the window crazy. I don't want to say nothing to you. I don't want to be too hard on the guys, you know? But first and foremost, I wanted to say, on an all serious note, before I even get to like the entertainment and because all at the end of the day, bro, I, I respect all these all these guys. They all athletes. I love football. Uh, they play for the Ravens, so at this moment, I love them. You know what I mean? Because I love the Ravens. But uh, I know I'd be trolling, I'd be hard on them with and stuff like that. But that that's more so entertainment and more so because I'd be mad and shit like that. Is I mean, at the end of the day, it's just football and it's just the NFL. But I wanted to say um. I wanted to say shout out to uh, JK man. Uh, everybody keep a prayer out for JK. Um, shoot, hit him, get in his DM, send him something, just send him some motivational words. Black and purple, just let him know he got people on his side. Hopefully, you got a good corner, man, because he didn't got hurt again um, with a, a torn Achilles, and that's just that's just so unfortunate, man. Never. Uh, besides, even. Besides even just the contract, it, it, besides it even being his contract, yeah, besides all that, which is devastating because he's going to miss out on, man, there's it's no telling how many millions he's going to miss out on because of the last few injuries. Besides all that, just the, the mental beating he, he's been taking over the last couple of years, fighting these injuries, battling these injuries, coming back, working out hard, and then getting yourself all the way back in shape after rehab and everything like that just to come out you get a touchdown you you, you still haven't been running the best but you but you're trying you, you, you're getting out there you, you and then you get hurt again and it's not even and it's Achilles this time it's not even an old injury it's just like damn man I I genuinely feel bad for uh for JK I genuinely feel bad for JK uh Obviously, we probably won't be moving on and signing them if, if, if we're just being realistic about the business of NFL and how it goes. Man, I, honestly, man, it might be even it might be hard for my my boy to even find, get a job. Man, he might have to. Uh, he's gonna have to show up to another team's uh, training camp and show out and go. He's gonna have to go crazy and get himself a spot. And it's probably not going to be for nowhere near amount of money as he deserved and wanted without the without the injuries. So yeah, shout out J.K. Praying for you, bro. It's fucked up. It's unfortunate, man. I think you're a beast. I think without the injuries, you'll be top five running back in the league. Hell, I think even with the injuries, you still one of the ones. Top five, top seven, top ten, one of the ones. You are, man. You run hard. You run. You. you you see, you see very well. Good vision. Shout out JK, man. But now that that's over, let's get to the dry. Let's get to the meat and potatoes. Let's get to the to the to the uh meat and potatoes. What? How did y'all feel about the offense? Now, what I'll say is, this is why we must play in the preseason. No one's saying. These guys should be playing very playing every preseason game or even playing a whole quarter for that matter. But this is why possess you need a few possessions. Like these guys need to be playing in the preseason, man. Not even just then Lamar had a terrible game, but we're not even just talking about Lamar. Look what just happened with the new highest paid the new highest paid quarterback in history. He just got skunked and got benched. He had 82 yards. These guys got to play preseason, man. These guys aren't that good. Let's just call a spade for a spade. These guys, I don't know if these guys are doing a study in that the, the Ray Lewis's and the Peyton Manners and Tom Brady's and all the greats. I don't know if these guys are doing that. I don't know if they're working out as hard. I, I don't know. I just know that they, they out there, they athletic, they nice and shit, they got talent, and they trying to get paid. I don't know. But I don't know if they're that good, yo. I really don't. They need they need a preseason game to get their feet wet. Lamar looked terrible. He had one good throw. He had one good throw. 
back shoulder to Odell. That was the only good throw he had. The play skill to, took forever to develop. Zay Flowers, ooh my God, go smell the flowers. Zay Flowers was disgusting. Zay Flowers is nasty. I can't wait to see more of him. I'm getting a jersey. I'm getting a jersey. My man's Chris said we got we splitting eight and a half and we going with four. Zay Flowers. So I'm I'm, I'm getting a jersey. I I enjoy watching Zay Flowers, but I feel like we would have done. Obviously, we won with ease. I feel like the defense played very well. Queen, oh my, hawk them down. And Patrick Queen, they they nasty. They're nasty. They're gonna be the best. They're gonna be the best, if not top three, one two uh, duo at linebacker in the league. They're they're, they're disgusting. In the, oh, what the hell? What the hell is going on? I don't know why I follow these people. I'm talking this shit. My bad, y'all. But um, yeah. Hartman down and Queen gonna be the top. They gonna be one. Of, they gonna be that. They go crazy. Mind you, we ain't no more Humphreys. Uh, uh God damn it. Let's get to the get to the other injuries besides J.K. Ronnie Stanley. Good lord, he can't catch a break either. Pray for him. Uh, Tyler Linderbaum. That's disgusting. Like, that's devastating. Oh my God, I love Tyler Linderbaum. He's been doing good since last year. Rookie year. Freaking oh, who else? Marcus uh, Williams again. Marcus. All right, all right now, Marcus Williams. Good, Lordy Georgie. Just got here last year. It's the second year in a row something that went wrong. It's a, we can't catch a break on the injury bug, man. We can't catch a break. Golly. And uh, what else, man? Oh, yeah. I was talking about the offense. But the, other than that, other than the injuries and all that, the de defense looked pretty decent. Um, Oh, we're not getting enough for the defense. We're not getting enough. Pressure on um from our front four or, or front five front five how front four I think we're not getting enough pressure from those guys so we're sending blitzes and leaving the middle wide open for receivers tight ends to just cut across they're gonna eventually get open on on cross routes drags and stuff like that we're leaving it we're leaving it dead smack open because we're blitz we got a blitz um hawk them down and and um Patrick, Patrick Queen. So that that's something we gotta uh we adjusted on that in the second half though. We definitely adjusted better on that and out uh we got more pressure. I mean we got like five, six sacks on the game, so I, I I can't be too mad. But I did notice that those those blitz schemes were giving up um large chunk large chunk plays on defense. Um back to the offense. Uh Odell, amazing catch. Uh obviously we wanna see we wanna see him get get it thrown to him a little bit more. These plays got to happen faster, man. These plays have to happen like actual football, like actual one, two, three, play. One, two, three, four, five, play. Like no no lineman is, can block for 10 seconds. The play, the plays can't develop. Like you can't take that long for the plays to develop. It, all, it turns in a backyard ball and increases the risk of turnover every time. Every time it's going to increase the risk of turnover. It needs to be real ball out there, man. That's what Lamar needs to be working on. And that's what playing in the preseason, a couple snaps in the preseason can help you out with. Get the feel. Um, I feel like I had something to say about our red zone play. It's all, it's, it should all be coming together. Now, I don't see, but the only thing is I don't like the fact that we treated this first week one game as a preseason game, regardless of if we won easily or not. This is supposed to be the year, man. We got to set ourselves uh, apart from, from everybody else and what everybody else doing. Now, uh, yeah, we got an easy win, but we ain't, we ain't cross our we ain't cross our T's and dot our I's, man. That's all I'm saying. I'm just a Ravens fan, though. Uh, yeah, Lamar, I need a better game out of you next week. And it's against Cincinnati. You have to play better. You, you have, you have to play better, man. You have to. Don't stop leaving the ball all out. Stop being stupid, man. You're not. Fuck. You're great. You're not that good, though, bro. Just calm down. What the fuck you running around with the ball all willy nilly for like this? Getting it smacked out of your hand, looking looking stupid. You pump faking a hundred times. He, he he doing like what are you? What are you? What is? What are we doing? Drive back. Throw the ball. Drive back and find an open receiver, please. When Odell caught it, it looked like he was 
Look, my fucking arm starting to hurt something. This video already be goddamn done. When um when Odell caught it, he he was looking like, yes, goddamn it, finally. Shit, let's go. Woo! Finally, let's go. Throw that bitch up. Odell looking at you like, throw that bitch up. Please. I need more. Feed me. Feed me. Now Zay ate. But god damn it, man. Everybody, everybody, everybody gotta eat. Shit. We ran the ball well as as usual, as always. But I was sold a dream, a dollar in a dream, like J. Cole, that we that we were supposed to be spreading the ball, getting to the playmakers. Now seeing it get to the playmaker, Zay Flowers, now I wanna see I wanna see some good throws. I wanna see some good good throws and I wanna see some plays made. I wanna see Bateman get involved. Really? Open Bateman. Come on, let's get Bateman going. We need him. We got to get him going. We got to. He spent last year. We got to get these guys going. Let's go. Will Aguilar, get him going. We only got Odell for one year. Shit. I, I don't need him just for pictures. I need some touchdowns, too. I'm just a Ravens fan, man. I'm out of here. Uh, I enjoy week one. I enjoy watching the Steelers get their ass kicked and the Bengals get their ass kicked. That's always... uh. That's always gonna be a plus. Now, if I would have hit on some goddamn parlays, now I would have had I would have had a perfect week one of the NFL season. But I didn't, and I'm gonna be back betting again this week, nigga. I'm just a Rams fan. I'm out of here, man.